Hey um, guys, I want to show you all how to basically how to dip in school. I'm not condoning, you know, dipping in school, etc. In no way, shape, or form am I telling y'all it is okay to dip in school, especially if you're underage. So, now. Basically, to start off, <clears throat> number one, what you can do is raise your hand, ask your teacher to go to the bathroom, and then you want to go to the bathroom, pop yourself a dip in, but you don't want to put it in the bottom, you don't want to put it in the side, you don't want to put it in the front, on either side. You want to put it in the top, like I got it right there. Upper decker make your pecker bigger. You want to put a upper decker in. That way, see, I'm talking regular like I'm, like I always do. Y'all wouldn't even notice it had I not even told y'all. Then number two. I cannot express this enough. If you have a weak stomach, just don't dip at all. What I personally do, like if I'm on the road, you know, I don't I don't carry my mud jug with me everywhere I go. So what I do is I'll take my drink, whatever I'm drinking whether it be soda, juice, water, whatever. And you don't even have to uh, you don't even have to spit in in your drink. Just gut it. Plain and simple. Now when you're in class, once you got your dip in, then you want to You don't want to have like, you know, say straight or original or something like that. You want to have something that's going to be a little bit refreshing. Like, you know, you go to talk to your teacher and, you know, you don't want to have something, you know, like coat in your mouth like snuff or Copenhagen original. You want to have something like As you can see, I did did just spit in my bottle. Son of a bitch. But it's mine. Fuck it. Anyway. Well, that's that's Alex. Apologize for that. Um You wanna have a good smelling dip. Like Copenhagen mint, grizzly mint, any kind of mint dip. And then what you want to do is, after you have your dip in, you know, you can either spit in this or gut it. Of course, you know, you don't want to be carrying your mud jug around, then, you know, they're going to raise questions. Then, what you can also do is add, um, get like a a dark container, not a mud jug, just a dark container like a bottle or a cup. And if you're using a cup, put soda, coffee, tea at the very bottom of it. That way, like, whenever you go to dip, you just. And then back down. Of course, yes, I I am aware that this is fucking clear. Alright. When you have your cup, fill it with quarter of the way, you know, tea, coke, whatever. That way, you know, whenever a teacher comes by and they're like, what are you doing? And, you know, they look inside your bottle and they try to smell it. It's just going to smell like coke or tea or coffee or whatever, you know, tits you're going to put in there. 
Sorry, I digressed. All right. Then you want to also have a a person that is going to buy your dip for one, because you know most of y'all sons of dicks are dip that are dipping in school are 14, 15, 16 year olds who aren't able to buy dip. Me personally I uh you know I never had that problem because you know I've always had facial hair and I naturally look older so you know I just go up to the store wherever I'm buying it and you know pick up the pick up the dip that way all right y'all well this has been another video and uh i'll see you on the next one later <laughs>